What's up guys and welcome to another FIFA 19 Pro Clubs video. Today on this video, I'm going to be giving you guys tips and tricks to how to reach max overall on FIFA 19 Pro Clubs. Now, as you guys know, FIFA 19 has only been out for a couple of days, so of course no one has yet reached maxed overall. But one thing that we can be certainly sure of is that FIFA 19 maxed overall is most likely going to be the same as FIFA 18 maxed overall and the reason for that is there's not that many changes in pro clubs but that is not 100 percent but we are pretty sure that that most likely that is the case uh first thing we're going to do is we're going to check the leaderboard for players with the most games uh playing more games in pro clubs pretty much will give you a higher overall and that's just how you can get a higher overall is by uh getting higher uh playing more games so first things first is we're going to go into the each position we're going to check what the max uh high overall is so for striker right now is 90 90 actually but i seen a 91 it tested me messi had a 91 max overall a higher highest overall striker he was using i think a 5 8 that's why he's max his, his overall was 91 i believe for a midfielder the highest i seen actually is a, a 91 cam and a cdm that had 90 overall i believe right there and then for defense the highest i seen is actually 89 um now you guys might be watching this game this video a bit further so those max those highest overall right now might change so keep that in mind when you guys are putting something in the comment uh the highest overall right now for a uh goalkeeper is 91 so those are the highest overall right now again fifa has only been out for a couple of days but again the reason why i say the more games you play the higher your overall is it's based on what i'm about to explain so when you play pro clubs on fifa 18 i actually made the similar video but it was seven months into the game but this time i'm bringing it a bit earlier so you guys have all the tools to be able to get your, your player to the highest overall as soon as possible so more games you play the highest overall is and the reason for that is there is something in game in pro clubs called base uh, xp which is something that you earn in game based on your match rating so your match rating goes from 0, 0.0 to 10.0 the highest you get that you get that uh average rating the more base xp you get so let's say for a 10.0 uh, uh game you get a thousand xp for myself, I have an average of 8.7, so every game I possibly get an 870 X base XP for that. If you get a 6.0, you only get in 600 base XP. There's also something called bonus XP. So bonus XP is based on um, doing things for your position. So if you're a striker scoring a goal, you get a base XP, uh, you get bonus XP for that. And if you uh, defender, you get a slide tackle, you get bonus XP for your slide tackle. So if you're a striker, you score a goal outside the box, you're gonna get a bonus XP towards your long shot and towards your shot power. So keep that in mind. Um, if you are a, a striker and you score inside the box, you get bonus XP for your finishing because finishing is for inside the box. So keep that in mind. Same thing for your goalkeeper. If you're a goalkeeper and you do a diving save, you're probably going to get your, you know, you do a reflex save. You're probably going to get a, a bonus XP towards your reflex diving. If you are accurate, accurate with your kicks as a goalkeeper, you're most likely going to get your kicking bonus XP for that. Even though it still has base XP in, into it, you're still going to get bonus XP. So keep that in mind. So the better you play in a game, the higher your match rating is and the more game you play eventually the fastest you will grow so keep that in mind now a striker there could be a striker with the same games as me 179 games but he might have an average rating of 6.0 so he might not be an 89 he might be an 87 88 with the same game so keep that in mind when you guys are putting those comments such as oh i played 180 games why am i not an 89 look at your match rating your match rating is very important and that's just how you grow next things i want to explain to you guys and i don't need to take a breath <laughs> but i'm trying to explain this to you guys and i don't want to make the video too long for you guys if you guys have a question put it in the description i'll answer that for you guys one by one the other thing is you have uh your player have a uh um uh, uh, uh attribute gap and what pretty much what that is is if you have if you see your player with 100% on a stat on an attribute like this on agility is, is 87 100% it's 88 actually 100% my balance is 81 100% so that means I will not be able to grow as a striker in those unless I go and play a different position so maybe if I go and play midfield I'll have a cam build maybe it will grow I'm not sure but my you can see my build dribbling and my ball control will still be able to grow. So these two will still be able to grow, but my uh, agility will not be able to grow with this build and this at this position. Same thing with my mid, uh, my passing. My passing, I'm a striker. It's all maxed out. But if I go and play as a cam, I am 100% sure I will be able to grow my uh, my attribute a bit higher than that. My shooting, because that's my primary skill, I can still grow on this, and that is something that you know you can just grow. Just keep that in mind. So if you have something 100%, like my 
free kick right now is 100%. If I take this out, it's 100% at 75. Unless the only way you're going to be able to grow that is if you use a skill point or um, if you go and play a different position and you you grow it that way. So if I wanted to go my free kick to grow, I will probably have to go and play cam and have that grow or use a skill point to put that higher. If you guys have a question or are confused on this, let me know. But if you do have 100% on that on an attribute, that means that the attribute for that specific position you're playing is maxed out and you will not be able to grow it anymore unless you use a skill point. Next thing is skill points. How do you earn them? The same thing as FIFA 18. On the screen right now, you guys can see how many games you have to play to get your max 110 skill points. It's the same thing as FIFA 18. You have to play 100 games to get 110 max skill points. Now, if you guys, on 18, you guys, a lot of you uh, were um, telling me that, oh, I played 100 games. I played more than 100 games and I still had, didn't have my 110 um, skill points. If that does happen, when you need to go, you need to go to customize, go to profile. You need to go to delete. And then you have to go to your delete your online pro one now what that does is it will delete your player customization only it will only delete your boots your face your player name that's all it will delete it will not delete your stats and it will not delete your overall so you guys don't have to to be uh, um, to be worried about that if that bug is still on fifa 8 if, if it is on fifa 19 i'm not sure if it is because i haven't had it if it is in the game that's what you need to do to um, get rid of it and then once you do that play some games and see if it works if it doesn't work Let me know in the comment section below and I'll be able to help you out So next thing I want to give you guys a big tip that a lot of people don't know a lot of people don't use it And you you guys actually might be, be missing out on it um, Sometimes um, and when you're playing with the build sometimes you might get a higher overall just by changing the height or the weight So I might be an 88 uh, an 89 with the 6 to 149 But I probably if I go to a 5 8 or something I probably will go only to an 80 let me see if it does happen just to just to check it might not because I have actually gained a lot but you can see right there so I'm playing with the 5 8 149 you see my build only is in 89 an 88 but if I go to my build that I usually use my 6 my 6 to 149 it will actually go to 89 so keep that in mind sometimes your weight and height will actually determine how what your overall is because of the fact of if you play a tall build uh, your player has been, you know, you've been winning header. And that's all based on your bonus XP. The next tip I want to give you guys is keep an eye on your um, on your percentage of each. So if I'm a striker, uh, this is on 20%. It's 91, 21% to 92. If I was to remove this, now it's 93% to 86, but it's only at 85. One thing you could do, this I do it a lot, play games without your traits, your skill points on that, just to get it to 86. Because this is plus 6, if I put all of these on, it's plus 6. But if I put it all 3 on, it's 91%, 91, 21% to 92. But if I take it off, it's 85%, 85 with 93% to 86. So if I let it grow to 86, I can go then and put all these plus 6 on, on then automatically have a 92 but if I go and keep playing like this, it will go slowly. So that's a tip that a lot of people don't use, and you can use it for a lot of your attributes. It's the same thing, it, it works in most. So my pace, you guys can see my acceleration is only, it's 90, 20% to 91, but if I was to take it off, it's 85, 71% to 86, and then I can put it all back on, and it will go back to, you know, it will jump into 91 faster than playing with all the traits on. If you guys have any questions about that as well, let me know in the comment section below. I'll be answering all the comments. If you guys enjoyed this video, those are all the tips I can give you guys on how to reach maxed overall. But guys, that's pretty much the whole video for you guys. Pretty much all you have to do on the game is play games, get a good match rating, pay attention to your uh, skill points, where you're using that, pay attention to the build you are using. And uh, again, if you guys have any questions, let me know in the comment section below. I will answer all the questions for you guys. If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up and also subscribe if you're new to the channel. More Pro Clubs content will be coming to the channel very soon. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will catch you guys later. Peace. Yeah.